Good morning. Welcome back to Houston Diaries episode two. We just finished up this crazy workout because of this man over here. This man over here. <laughs> huh? I don't know. If I gotta sign a waiver to get into a place, bro, I gotta, I gotta second guess that one. Oh man, it wasn't terrible. It wasn't the best, but it wasn't. Nah. Would I do it again? No. No. Nah. 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 Would. Once a week, maybe twice a week, like a Monday, Friday, I would. Yeah. But I don't know, like every day. Do it, bro. The better, like. It feels. How often do you come here? But there's week. There's been weeks where I come here like every day. Oh, you're wilding. Yeah. You're built different though. Yes. Yeah, so uh, like five. If there's five days, Monday through Friday, mm -hmm. I come like. The most I've I'm saying I can I can do this twice a good twice a week. Yeah. But. I like coming on leg days. I feel like. What was today? Today was like. Oh, for you guys, yeah. It's usually always full body, but okay. today was like conditioning. Okay. It was a lot of cardio. I didn't realize how 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 out of shape I was. Yeah. No. Until I got to them little mountain climbers. You nah. Can run as many miles as That's possible. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, I can sprint. <laughs> I can sprint as fast as I can. This is nah. It's OD. Hold on, man. It's the it's, it's the man, the myth, the legend himself. Hold on. Oh man, good two, Kango dial. Two times shit. This is, that was some real painful type shit. How y'all feel, bro? I feel dead. Nah, this shit, this is not like a good feel great after the work. I think you feel like shit. Nah, bro. Like as some ass and as ex athletes, y'all know this is nah, 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 bro. This, it's not. Then bad, then bad. Oh god. Oh man. What is that? Um, a scramble. A what? A southwest scramble. Southwest scramble. Mm -hmm, with Frito Lay's on top. Frito Lay's. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, so it's been about a smooth hour or two since the workout. Uh, we ended up stopping at this little spot to go get brunch. It was decent. The food was low key trash, and the water tastes like toilet bowl water. Oh god! But now we're back at the Airbnb. I didn't get to give you guys like a real tour. I know it's kind of already messed up, but this is our suite here. Boom. Nice two big old windows. These windows are electric, by the way, too. And side note, I didn't tell you guys beforehand, but if you guys do know. My last job, I worked with interior design and we, like my company specialized in like motorized shades. So like I, I got the ins and outs on what them things are. Um, but the room is valid. Here's the bathroom. The bathroom is low key by five. I ain't gonna hold you. Like I already obviously got all set up. You feel me with the little heats, heat skis from the weekend. Boom, boom. But this bathroom area is so dope. Big ass shower. You walk in, in the shower alone and you got a regular little like shower rod. Got the sky shower, big vibes, big comfy vibes, big, big old bathtub. I'm definitely gonna use this at some point to like sit in, sit in the bathtub on some like Russell Simmons type vibe. Like if you know Russell Simmons from like Ren's house, he was sitting in the bathtub on his Blackberry. That's the type I'm gonna be on. Uh, bathroom vibes, bathroom, kind of like a little bidet, is that the name? But I think it's called a bidet, the thing that shoots up your butthole. I'm not gonna use it, but they got one. But no, nah, bathroom is, is valid, valid, 100% valid. There's two other rooms in here. Uh, Kelly's staying in the one down here, and then Viv is staying upstairs. But then we go downstairs to the living room area, and like the common area is big box, big box, big box, big living room. There's a balcony there, and there's another one that's upstairs, but big living room vibes. Um, I haven't actually really explored like the living room situation yet, but I do know there's an elevator in here. So there's an elevator it takes you from the first floor, which is below, up to the third floor, which I think there's a fourth floor too. There's a balcony up top. But living area, boom, vibey. Whoever like designed this home had like a vision because like, you know when things don't match, but it goes with like the spot, that's kind of what I feel like this house is. Like everything is kind of random, but it all just kind of goes together. Uh, it gives like a super modern, you got the black and white table type vibes. Marble countertops, big old fridge, so. Airbnb is vibe. So big shout out to Lex and Naka Power the family. They really showed us some love with this spot. Um, but the game plan for the rest of the day, let me just put y'all down right here. The game plan for the rest of the day. 
basically for the rest of the day. We have a shoot coming up in about an hour or so. We gotta drive down to the Naka Power Warehouse where I was in the last vlog. Um, we're gonna be shooting there for the new collection that drops. Can I have the camera? Oh. We're gonna be shooting for the next collection that drops, the Concrete Jungle Collection. So some of the stuff that I was shooting in the last vlog is what we'll be shooting for today. Like we'll do group shots, you know, everybody will be there shooting. And then, that's pretty much it for the rest of the day, honestly. And then tomorrow, I think we may, me and her may do something later tonight, maybe go out to dinner, get like a bite to eat. There's a restaurant that's across the street from the Airbnb that's, that's super valid that we pulled up. You know, we pulled up on it, we just saw it. It kind of gives like super like Italy, like dim lights, pasta vibes. So we'll probably check that out later on tonight. And then tomorrow we'll be back at it again with another workout or with another day of shooting. But all in all so far, Texas is hot, it's dusty. All the fast food spots have been trash. I had Jack in the Box, it was ass. Baby had McDonald's and that shit was trash. But the Airbnb is valid. All right, so the time for us to leave for the shoot has come. But before we go, I'm about to slide over to this little liquor store and get some energy drinks. Because the boy's tired, bro. That, that, that Kangol workout this morning that y'all saw was like ridiculous, bro. Oh, it's bright out here, gang. I'm out here. Hey, I'm not gonna lie, Houston is like low-key giving ghetto, bro. I ain't gonna hold you. It's giving like Southern ghetto. You know how like, you know, you got these Southern streets and shit like that? But Houston is like mad low-key ghetto. I drove through Fifth Ward. I don't know if anybody from Houston watched my vlog, but y'all know where Fifth Ward is. Shit, I was in the streets and the trenches with it, gang. In the building. What's going on, man? My guy. What's going on, gang? It's my first time in your video, right? That's what I'm saying, bro. Yeah. It's a guest appearance. The Let's go. Show. So we're back in the building, back in the warehouse, getting these shots in, you feel me? Oh, my boy Nick over there sweating his life off. It's alright, though. <laughs> <sighs> it's currently half time of the shoot. What time is it right now? Do you know? Seven. It is seven? Yeah. Bruh. Like it's 7, it's currently 5 a LA time, but it's 7 p.m. We got here at 3, so if y'all do the math, we've been shooting for the past 4 hours. And we still ain't done yet, it's half time, we just ate some Chick-fil-A. But, so far, good vibes. How are you feeling so far? I'm ready to go home. <laughs> you guys, we have the biggest bathtub. I'm ready to just... Ow, ow. <laughs> 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 Alright gang, that's it, I'm tired bro, I just took a shower, I'm gonna eat my little strawberry shortcake ice cream and call it a day, so it was a long day from getting up at the ass crack of dawn, to working out, to shooting for about 5-6 hours, to being in this heat, your boy exhausted bro, so we're gonna tap in with y'all tomorrow, at Alpha Land at 10 a.m. Central Standard Time. You feel me? I'm gonna try to get some editing done tonight. No guarantees. But all in all, today was cool. Long day, nonetheless, but it was cool. Good vibes, good foods, good people, good shooting, the whole nine. Ay, yeah, yeah. All right, I'm out of here. That ice cream game. Episode 2. It's 9.25 a.m. And I'm awake. Barely. I'm tired, bro. Last night I stayed up till about 1. Trying to get some, like, Instagram stuff posted. Just because throughout this whole trip, I haven't had a chance to, like, really edit anything. I've just been, like, on the move. And then we spend, like, these long and extensive hours shooting. And then I come back home and I'm dead-ass tired. So I tried to put a little reel together that I'll be posting in about a couple hours. But... Game plan for today, I feel like we're gonna be at Alpha Line for a long time. There's, we're shooting video content today and not photos. Um, so that should be fun for the most part. 
Um, they also let us know if we wanted to work out afterwards. We could stay there and work out, but in my mind, I'm like, huh. Oh, sorry. Are my lips white? <laughs> sorry, whatever. Um, yeah, they told us we could work out afterwards, but if I'm at the gym all day long, the last thing I want to do is stay at the gym and work out. So we're going to see what that is like when I get there. But for the time being, I got my conche. If you, if you know, you know type time. There's a little bakery right across the street. Uh, I mean, Leslie just walked to and good vibes. I, I, I want to try the tacos. They got some good tacos that I saw on the menu. So I might go back there for like lunch tomorrow or something. Tomorrow's Saturday, right? Yeah, I might go back there to lunch tomorrow. Um, but that's the vibe for today. We don't got to leave for another maybe 45 minutes or so. So I'm going to eat this little breakfast. Try to get some like stuff in line to post maybe tomorrow or Sunday. And then pack my shit up and then we out of here. So Did I tell you I'm tired? Because I'm tired, bro. I'm, I'm, I'm beyond tired. Alright guys, this is the Anaka headquarters, you feel me? Some super presidential vibes, black chairs, a nice interior design. That was probably done by Shali and his team. This is a whole vibe. They got the bar on deck. Are we getting twisted today? Well, hold on. Are we getting twisted today or not? But overall, bro, I'm in. For those of you guys who like aren't in the fitness scene and that know about like Alpha Beat and Alpha Land, the gym and the it, it exceeds expectation by far, hands down. Exceeds expectation by, I'm in, you see me, I'm, I'm shocked, bro. Yeah. Oh, 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 shit. Shit, yeah, yeah, going stupid with, with the coves on. That's what we're doing today, yeah? Hey, man. Hey, it's the game for the two, bro. It's for the two. It's the game for the two. It's the strongest nigga in Houston. No cap, nigga. No cap, nigga. I wish. No cap, I wish. No cap. He got me. He got me. Oh. All right, so we're done shooting. I'm about to get some food over here at Alphalene. So, my take on being here at Alphalene so far for the first time is definitely a vibe. It's too hot, though, bro. It is OD hot, but I know it's just Houston heat type shit. But I'm about to get some tacos, and then we all get the first official session in at Offline. I gotta try to film this in a way where I can post this also on IG. So I'm gonna do the whole mic up, the whole the whole thing, the whole thing. So we gonna, we gonna see for sure. But yesterday I had, or Tuesday I had some food, and it wasn't it wasn't that good. I'm not gonna hold you. But the tacos look fine. So we gonna try to get some tacos, and then see see what the workout talking about. First take, see what this time. I'm talking about. Man. 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 That shit, bro. That's your hair? Man. Man. That shit. Super simple, super light. Right before a workout? Good. Alright.
So we worked up to a top set so far, 405. I think I'm gonna go 455. I think so. I feel like the weight's not strong enough or not heavy enough, obviously, but low key, I messed, I fucked up. I, my racks are too high, so I struggle to get the shit off the, off the rack. So I might get a spot to help me get off, but we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna knock out 455 for sure. Easy peasy. Oh. Oh. 4.55 ain't move that bad. I'm not gonna hold you, ain't move that bad. I'm gonna go 365 for a couple sets and then we gonna go into some bodybuilding like straight pump, straight muscle man type timing. Cause one, I don't wanna be here that long and two, I don't really feel like working out. So I know y'all, I always tell you all the time, bro. I don't feel like working out, but it's one of those things I just don't. And it's cool, it is what it is. So let me get a couple sets up here and then I'm gonna get up out of this squat section because I'm, no, no, no. My legs are already fried, bro. Golly. Oh yeah. It's not heavy enough. It's not heavy enough. Woo, I'm beat, bro. I'm tired. Squash so took everything out of me. I'm tired, gang. Come on. It's, it's getting crazy over here, you know, we've been shooting all day, but we still in the lab getting very painful. The shit has not stopped. Even the ladies is getting crazy, you know. Everybody's in here just getting good work. The vibes is right, right, Kelly? Yeah. Okay. Hold on. Over here getting real painful. Yeah. Big arms. See? that? The, the, those are the kind of arms that'll knock a nigga out right there. That'll put a nigga with, right with, uh, 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 I don't want to say his name. Never mind. That was crazy. All right, gang, finished up the workout a good 45 minutes ago. And let me tell you, Alpha Land, the W's in the chat. Alpha E's, W. Gym vibes was A1. All the homies was getting into work. You feel me? Got to see a good homie from back home. But right now, it's that time. So I might break this into a separate video, but if not, you'll see it right now. But we're about to go try Trill Burger. If you guys are in the Houston area or you're on social media at some way or at some point in time of your day, you'll saw that you saw that Drake went to Trill Burger like, Three weeks ago, right? And if Aubrey Graham goes, I gotta go. Oh, is that way? So we're gonna go try Trill Burger real quick. Then we're also gonna charge this Tesla real quick. But Trill Burger is definitely important. Um, so I might shoot like a mukbang and give y'all like my truest, honest opinion on it. But right now, we finna go eat. We finna eat. No, we finna, we finna, we finna chomp it up. Ah! You know what I mean? She acting like she ain't got no sense. That's how good life goes on, yes, King. Yes, Welcome sir. to Trill Burger, yes, though. Yes, sir. How about that? Hello. Yeah. All day. <laughs> Ooh, that sauce is dead. This is what the Trill Burger looks like. All my food lovers. Ooh, this shit looks sloppy. I like that. All right. That's it for the video. Okay. Yes, Trill Burger is definitely a W. Big W's if you're in the Houston area. You have to try Trill Burger. You have to, bro. I'm not, it's not like a maybe I should go. It's not. Nah, you've got to go. But that's it. We're going out tonight. So this might be the end of today's video because I'm going to probably show you the Fiskies or whatever later on. But that's pretty, pretty much it. But Trill Burger, W's in the chat game. Completely through and through. All right? Yeah. What you mean, let me look it up for? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, gang. I'm gone.